What's up guys, Max here and welcome back to another video. In my last video I set a timer for one hour to hunt bots at revs and I was amazed at the profit. Go check that video out if you haven't yet. During that video I realized how many bots are just logging in and out constantly in Revenants. So I had the idea maybe I could rush these bots as they log in and possibly get them before they teleport. It's going to take a little bit of testing but I'm sure I could figure out how to get a couple kills there. This obviously isn't the setup I'm going to go in, so I'm going to go head over to the G and see what gear I can pick up to maybe get the max potential out of my weapons. Alright, here's the best gear I could come up with. I don't think that uh, the regen brace is going to matter. It gives me one strength, so I'm probably going to use mithril gloves. Really hoping I don't die because I have my B-ring eye with me, and I don't think I have the points to get another one. I think the bots are going to be too fast uh, to do two specs with the claws, so I'm probably going to have to try a different combo. That's why I got some different gear in my inventory. I'm going to have to be a little bit sneaky to try not to run into players. I think I'm going to start over at the Hobgoblin, so let's head there now. Alright, we're almost in here. Hopefully there's uh, the same amount of bots that were in my last video. I don't know if you saw it, but it was absolutely insane. Hundreds were just logging in, logging in, logging in, logging in. Let's see if we can maybe get one of these guys. Uh, you know what, I should have maybe brought a bracelet of Ethereum so I don't jump by these guys constantly, the Hobgoblins. Uh, let's super combat up. Better have our prayer ready to go. We're just gonna try a claw spec off the bat. That's uh, enough to do it, that'd be great. Also unsculled at the moment, which could play a factor in all this. That's big. Almost one shot him. So they definitely, uh, you only get one spec off it seems. That was cool though. I almost one shot that guy. Alright, we're going back up with the G Mall. This is the new strat. Um, I did bring in Tangles and a magic robe bottom switch just in case I have to try to get under someone and log out. Because I am risking a decent bit here. I guess I'll keep my B ring now if I do die. So hopefully the G Mall is the strat. I also was thinking maybe I take the Elder Mall. Got this guy trapped up here, which uh, makes it so I can keep my gloves on and stand right here. This seems to be where they log in most of the time, too. Ooh, I don't want to deal with that. Is that a Void Waker he had? Oh, God damn it. I, I'm watching for 10 minutes plus and I go to take a drink and the second I do, someone logs in. <laughs> I thought that was a person for a second. This isn't going well for me. You know what? Even better. I'm going to go try at the Demons. Don't know exactly where they're going to be logging in and out, but I'm guessing the middle is a pretty safe bet. I really need to be able to get to them ASAP so I can get the specs off. Oh, that was a nice try. That was a 92 as well. I don't know if that was a bot, but if he was any lower level, any lower defense, I probably could have gotten him. So, someone mentioned in my comments in my last video that everyone, all the bots are using crossbows because there's some sort of glitch going on where you can stay on task all the time. I don't know if that's true, I couldn't find anything about it um, anywhere on the internet, but if you do know about that, let me know. I do play an Iron Man for anyone who hasn't seen uh, my progress series that is currently on hiatus. Oh, that was perfect! He just... I didn't hit high enough. That's... it's gonna work. I know it's gonna work. I'm really tempted to get the Elder Mall out. I know there's a delay on the spec bar when you switch into the G Mall though. Oh, once Elder Mall gets a spec bar, it's gonna be amazing for this. Could also try AGS into G Mall, but it's just hard. Sometimes you're standing there for five minutes waiting for someone to log in. Oh, that's a good hit. We got him. It wasn't scold, but that's definitely a bot down. 579k, and he had no loot on him. That's just the basic uh, bot loot. Just reset my loot tracker. I always forget to put the first loot in. Alright, I'm grabbing the Elder Mall. Might be stupid. Uh, <laughs> this thing is now worth, let's see, almost 144 mil. I bought it for 28 mil a few weeks ago, so <laughs> let's hope we don't lose it. I think, let's see how this looks. Yeah, it's a little slow to switch, but I sh should still be able to get my uh, G Malls off. Somehow these bots know not to run from each other, which is interesting to me. I guess it's just a setup. Maybe I could use that to my advantage, but who knows. Ah, uh, such bad hits. I feel like I could have gotten two claw specs off there. Maybe I'll go back to trying claws out for a minute. Oof. 
That's not good. Ooh, this is real bad. This is very, very bad. Ah, uh, smite it too. Oh, got my claws. Uh, I was not prepared for that at all. Oh, it says I've been refunded my points for my uh, ring somehow. Okay, kept my fire cape. Everything's good. We're good. That guy was an absolute powerhouse. I don't know how much of it I got on recording, but he was doing so much DPS. Wait, he had mage cape switch? He was using both? That's crazy that he was even spellbook swapping. I mean, I guess it was worth it because he got... You know, almost got my claws, and he got quite a bit of money. Jesus, B-rings are up to 5.6 mil now. Oh, that was an expensive death. I don't even... You know what? I didn't even look how much the Fremenic kilt was and everything. It was like a 10 mil death. I'm just going to lose one max hit uh, from the Brimstone Ring, but that's not a big deal. A little more defense. I'm going to remember to bring a uh, Anti-Venom this time as well. While I'm here, I'm kind of thinking I want to try just camping inside the door for a minute. Video, we're not worried about money. Last video was about making money, and I showed that I can make 7 mil in an hour PKing bots, so just have to do that for an hour to make that death back. Seems like I'm not going to be able to get bots there. Okay, I gotta get someone at least. Damn it. Today's just one of those days where I'm like, why do I have a PKing channel if I'm not good at PKing? I don't know the answer to that question, but I intend to get better at PKing, and you know what, I do know the answer. I think it's because I want to make PKing seem a little more accessible to other people that are kind of around my skill level that want to get into it. Big spec, come on. One more. Ah. Got Prey Melee on way too quick. How do I not just go for this guy? I didn't even know I could hit that high. <laughs> There's a good chance there. Oh, I got him! No way, I didn't think that would work. Alright, let's check these keys out. Not bad! If I get the Avarice, I'll be stoked. No, no Avarice or anything. Something about the AGS, I don't think they're picking up though. Kind of nice to try different things out here, because uh, you learn weird stuff, and sometimes you can break a bot farm if you're uh, persistent enough. No! No, I went for that guy and then this guy logged in! Uh, just, it's not good, it's not good! Oh, thank god. I don't know what it is, but I've looted about five free bracelets of ethereum off the ground oh that was it man i think considering that i'm just sitting here waiting for like minutes on end for someone to log in uh might just be better to be using the gmall like i am now probably a little less reliable for getting the kill but i'm not gonna botch the spec every other time all right it's a new day i'm gonna try losing my skull in between it's gonna take a lot longer but i think it might help me get some kills Oh, that was that almost worked. I think not. Oh, if I had a recoil on, he was dead. There we go. Oh, come on! I thought it worked that time. He didn't log out immediately. Nice. Guess that's one way to do it. I don't even need the Gmall. Finally got one. Okay, let's see. 500k, not bad. He didn't have any loot. I wonder if that had anything to do with him, like, not tallying or whatever. Uh, 
This is not good. Holy shit. It turned out to be really nice, um, but uh, I do need a sympathy like so if you have any sympathy for my misery uh, during this video that I've almost canned three times, please leave a like. Alright, we're geared back up. We got another Beering Eye because for some reason I got my points back when I died for it earlier. Um, and we're going back in. If I die again, that's the video over for me. Let's just try to get a couple kills before that happens. Um, I'm going to try my best also to lose my skull in between. It adds so much time, so it makes me not want to do it. But honestly, if I had done that, those two deaths, I would not have lost everything. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, how did he know? I guess I just went back up on the same world. How did he know where I was at? I'm gonna sniff him out here. Definitely a scout somewhere. We're hopping very far away. If he finds me again, I don't know what the deal is. Something strange is happening. This guy steps over here to get his loot, then he'll be in high enough combat. I'm gonna see if he does it. Hopefully he gets loot here. I can definitely one-hit him. Oh, he did it! I knew it was gonna work. That's so funny. Bot had one level to do it. That's so sick. I don't have any teleport out right now. This is so bad. We're going north to this uh, gate. Less likely to get PK'd going in. Oh, there's a pier right there. All right, we made it through. Let's loot this key. Interesting. Is that a Berserker Helm? Weird. Oh, I got him. One shot. Nice. I'm getting lucky on these AGS specs, but that's kind of the best way to do it for me right now. All the damage is in that first tick. Come on, something good. 500k, not bad. Big four points for uh, resetting your skull. Oh, there we go. Got him. That feels so good when it happens. It doesn't happen that often. It's taken me like a couple tries in between, but that's awesome. Another 600k. I just died to a PK -er, and in my rage trying to save the clip I just turned off my shadow play so I think that's gonna be it for me today. Not to sound suspicious but these people definitely scouted me somehow. I think they must have people at the Ferox Enclave. Um, I wish I saved that clip because it was the same thing where as soon as I was running in they uh, just kind of ran down and TB'd me. On a good note, I did get my Nightmare Zone points back. I don't know why that happens, but I'm happy about it. Overall, this was not that successful of a video. I made 4.5 mil if you include that first kill that I didn't have on the tracker, but honestly, that pales in comparison to the 30 plus mil I lost by dying. I was curious though, and sometimes you find something cool when you test things out like this. It was pretty fun, and I'd be curious to see if anyone else uh, had any luck doing something like this, so make sure you guys go and test it out, and that is not me trying to bait you in to make my money back. <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, I have some more cool stuff coming soon. Um, I'm really thinking about doing a series, building a new pure. The only reason I'm hesitant to make it is because I don't want the videos to flop, so if you want to see that, make sure to let me know in the comments as well. Alright guys, until next time.